think we can actually um, start the episode on the... Oh, do you want to start here? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah, I kind of did this with a gag. Oh, yeah, you're just... <laughs> you're <laughs> hanging just... way out there. Anyway, we found the lore. Mm -hmm. it, was, it was tucked away behind a corner in one of those, like, yeah. dishes. It was inside us all along. Woohoo! Get a different pose. There's a little hat on it. Mm hmm? I don't know if I noticed that last Wouldn't time. Can you give it a hat if you could? Yeah. Many travelers find themselves in Angopolis Square at some point in their journey. Youth from far flung seas gather in this colorful hub of comings, goings, meetings, and farewells. Is that Pearl? No, no that's, that's not Pearl. Uh, but it's one of Annie? The... Is that her name? Is that Annie? She's the one I with can't the. Tell. Oh. She's on the funky hair. It doesn't I mean it doesn't look like she has a whole anemone going on there. Maybe it's just a she's not like a hat. She she's just there. Alright. Gotta find two more zapfish somewhere. Two more blast fish. Oh, a completely different kind of animal there. Blastfish? Yeah, hmm. so that sounds like it'd be yeah. some kind of armaments in this well, game. Well, yeah, that, that, that's the, I mean, like, blastfish are what they use for blast processing. Mm. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. There we go. Oh, sponge. Well, what's our next fest? Yeah. Uh, oh, yeah, let me, let me pull it up. Uh, Enter the Octo Hurler. Let it roll. Sheldon request. I'm going to, uh, like... I'm gonna guess that this is uh, holiday themed because otherwise it probably wouldn't make much sense. <laughs> uh, sweater or sock? Oh, yeah. Huh. What would you rather receive as a gift? Mm. This with you to go home and gather some practical data. This is the hero roller. You can fling a big wall of ink while on the ground with R Z R. Okay. I would rather receive a sock as a gift. Yeah, because I'm not really a sweater person. Like if I'm if I want to wear something warm, I'll put on a jacket. I think. I can, I, I can be a sweater person, but like, I'd, I'd like to choose them myself, I yeah, guess. Yeah. I mean, if I'm, if I'm being real, like, I've got enough socks, I'd, I'd go sweaters. I, 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 I have like a really good, like, pair of socks that are like, like very thick and they have like, little, like, rubber, like, things on the underside, so that they're like, oh, Valonium bundles. Mm, nice. Although, actually, now that I think about it, like, do all sweaters have that texture? No, no. Okay. I'm a bit more okay with it then. But like, if all sweaters have that texture, then I would go They're socks. They're not all fuzzy, all, mm -hmm. all like... Yeah, all I'm imagining this is like Christmas sweaters and socks respectively. Yeah, yeah. So maybe they are splat yes. in this example. If it's Christmas socks, then actually I'm down for that. Yeah. Like well, yeah. cold it's weather like, socks are amazing. Yeah. But like, like, you know, Fun socks can be fun, and if I don't like them, like no one's gonna, no, no one's gonna notice if you're not wearing a particular pair of socks. Mm -hmm. Ah, uh, yeah. So, uh, Pearl was on team sweater. Marina is on team socks, huh. and right. team sweater won. Really? Yeah. Huh. Yeah, I, I can see that. Yeah, I guess. Sweaters are, are, the, are the more mainstream yeah. <laughs> option. Socks are like the classic, oh, I got this for Christmas thing. It's like getting yeah. a rock for Halloween. Thanks, like, 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 yeah, I, th I feel like socks are something you learn to appreciate like more in your life. Yeah. Yeah. Some, some good socks. I mean, I feel like as you get older, it's less about like a lot of clothes and more oh, about uh, having something. a few really good clothes that you like. Oh, yeah. You're, I just noticed oh, wow. that you're using the, the, the roller. roller. Yeah. I like it so far. Or, uh, well, like, actually, but this is gonna be hard, isn't it? I don't know it works. Splat rolling the Mojave. Yeah, this was this was splat rolling the Mojave of English. Really, Carol Knuckle, you wet us wish for a nuclear wetter. <laughs> I was trying to make it like all soggy. Uh, yeah, a nuclear. <laughs> Oops, thunder. Oh, this is something. Nope. There you go with your impulsive secret finding again. Yeah. yeah the roller is what I use. I play multiplayer usually. Right. Yeah, like like it it, it it achieves the goal of like covering places. Yeah, it feels really the, the, easy. The, the, the in like how you win in uh, I guess the main or like in turf war. If you I, roll someone over, do they just die instantly? Yes, but you have to have like good aim. Okay. 
get in with this thing? It's huge. Yeah, but it's like huge. It, I, I think that has different damage outputs on the edge and in the center. Ah, okay. Like you have to really squarely hit someone to instantly kill them. More octopods? So annoying. Uh -huh. I do also like the new octopods, though. If I was going to slap them, I thought they would thing. just run into it. <laughs> yeah, the dualies were fun. They're just good. And they have the dodge. Oh, hey, didn't see you there. But while you're here, I guess I could remind you that there's a link to my Kofi in the description. You know, just in case you like what we do here enough to give a little donation. No pressure. Oh, and like and subscribe or whatever. I like how it's like on the side like that. Like you, but then it like hmm. comes out. Yeah. Like an Octobomber. Pasteurize this dirt bag. Pasteurize? Yeah, what is... Like, oh. like wait for him to be, like, drinkable? Or what the fuck does pasteurize mean again? It's, I don't know. It's, it's like, like a thing you do to a, milk. It's a yeah. farm word. Yeah. Actually, you know what? Fuck this guy. I still have these. Eat this. Oh. Well, he's like flying. I don't know how well that's. Oh yeah, that works. Well, definitely got something. <laughs> I can just do more. It might just be faster to just keep doing the rolls. <laughs> On my way, dirt bags. Oh. Oh, they're, yeah. they're probably something back there. Pasteurize <laughs> me, Captain. Ah <laughs> <laughs> oh, man, that sounds Ca bad. Capturize me, Pastor. <laughs> 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 Was that like a Pokemon thing? <laughs> like, well, yeah, there's s might be something back uh, there. Like, is there like a? Uh, I don't know. That no. was just the way you were supposed to go. This is having the roller makes me want to cover the round in ink. Yeah. Ink your splat zone. Yeah. <laughs> Marina would want to watch that. By the way, Octo Hurlers throw rolonium at you. Thought you might want to know. Oh, Donkey Kong. Uh, Nerf Spike! That too. Wait, what? Oh, Donkey Kong, like, the arcade. Throwing barrels, arcade. yeah. 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 Like, uh, even in his own games, he throw the barrel. Yeah. Oh! oh, oh that's... No, that, that is Spike. <laughs> yeah. Donkey Kong can't do that. <laughs> uh, if it was bananas, he could probably do that. <laughs> like a big bundle of bananas. What a pro. I, I do think, like, a lot of, of these enemy Octarians are, like, genetically engineered in some sort of way. Yeah. Yeah. I, I agree. They definitely seem like, you know, they, they do a thing. There's a lasagna in the back, but first you have to get past those Octahurlers. Mm. Ah! Oh. Hmm. Oh, hey. If you can, if you can aim at them. Yeah. Ah, well. Uh, that sucks. It works, but yeah, you, it works if you, like, you do it right. It works if you're prepared for it. <laughs> we got some things going on here. I guess I probably should have just aimed it, like, because they're going in that order. Probably should have just done that. Nah, nah, fuck! They can aim. That was yeah. It was pointed right down at you. Yeah. I'll just, uh, excuse me. Is there, I think if you follow one of those down, maybe there's something there? Maybe. But I want to get uh, the enemies off of the platforms know. first. Oh yeah, oh yeah, you can, you can do that. Because there's, I see those things revolving, and I feel like, and they're going below there, so I feel like... Oh, no. <laughs> nice kill zone. Thanks. Yeah. My favorite Marvel villain. <laughs> Killmonger? Yeah, maybe. <laughs> Was that a Killmonger joke? I mean, yeah, but he's also not my favorite Marvel villain. He's just huh? a guy. Yeah. Oh, yeah! There's some... I knew it. Alright, that's, yeah. all, that's all the, the cool things in this level. Yeah. Who is your favorite Marvel villain? Wow, that's a good question, huh? Uh, I don't... Um... I'm trying to think about it. Honestly, when he is a villain, I think Winter Soldier has had some of the coolest fights. 
Like mm-hmm. he he has a, exactly one gimmick and he utilizes it really well. Arm? Yes. Fuck. What's your soldier for arms? <laughs> like it's just one arm. He has so. a gun though. Well, that would be an. That, that's how he extends his reach. Mm-hmm. I don't know. I kind of, I kind of set myself up to get caught off guard by that question. The favorite yeah. Marvel villain. I mean, I asked because it seems like you had an answer, but I guess you didn't have one prepared. Uh, I mean, there's been a lot of good ones. A lot of very generic and not good ones, also. Yeah. Well, like. Hmm, like I, I mean, you know, there are plenty of ones that are the like, you know, like these, you know, they have like completely justified morals, but then also they're okay with killing children. Mm-hmm. Like, I uh, like Nebula, but I like her a lot more as like part of the team. Just a little, Nebula. just a little father. That's fair. So I don't know if that counts. Yeah, Nebula's story is fucked up. Like it's fucked up that she basically never lost to Gamora because. That insin- the insinuation there is that if Gamora had ever lost, won? Or, yeah, 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 like because the, the insinuation there is like Thanos was like, okay, both of you are gonna fight every time one of you loses, uh, you're gonna get upgraded, right? But like since Gamora never lost, she never got upgraded, and like I think there was potential to be like, yeah, she has like one or two cybernetic, you know, she lost like a few times, she got like an eye maybe. Like it could have made Gamora more interesting than just being green girl with boobies. Yeah, but also her having never lost is her whole thing. <laughs> yeah, being perfect Thanos' daughter. I mean, it's kind of cheating to say Thanos is your favorite villain, right? Yeah, no. That, Thanos he just is gets not. the most like going for him, as opposed to like, you know, a mirror of the hero for a mirror match at the end. Mm-hmm. Oh, like I, I do really like uh, Spider-Man. Homecoming. Yeah, the vulture. Vulture. Oh, yeah. Yeah. yeah, yeah. Like, I, I like him. I like that he's like an intimidating dad character. He's got like, the best villain scene, like in that car. Yeah. Let me check your weapon log. Yep, data's coming through. Oh man, this is really good stuff. The more data you get me, the quicker I can finalize my retail version. So keep it up. But remember, this is just a loaner. I'm not running a charity here. Oh, this is the same thing. Good luck, Agent Four. Cool. That is basically huh. the shotgun that I asked for. This looks to be a do-it-yourself guide for starting your own mobile business. It looks new, but somebody must have been frying something near it. It has some grease stains on it. Crusty Sean. Yeah, and, and if we're going beyond the, the movies Ooh. into the comics, then uh, then my, favorite's, uh, my favorite villain is Ms. Quizzler. Oh, yeah. Hmm. I, I would have to think about uh, the villain. Like, yeah, Marvel. I, I enjoy, like... From the comics I've seen of, with him, I, I like um, uh, Craven the Hunter. Oh, yeah. Yeah. It's just fun. He has a thing and he goes with it. I think we're done. Yeah. Probably the Joker. <laughs> <laughs>